Most consumers of electricity in Nigeria on daily basis continue to suffer erratic and unsafe supply across the urban and rural areas in the country. Pain and frustration remain visible on the faces of electricity consumers in the Federal Capital Territory. What exactly have the 11 distribution companies done or doing to remedy the problem as it cuts across? Our concern now is giving us this energy the ones we have paid you for. So sometimes we bring light just 30 minutes, especially at night. Okay, no, it's a night, but will be on. Okay, but will be on from night. See what water that I put inside it's water. It get there's no light. If the worsening power supply has ached most customers, the increase in tariff as witnessed by consumers is another sore point. Those under the estimated billing system complain of consistent growth in rates. Even those customers on prepaid meter arrangement have also continued to complain about lesser credit for same amounts bought. Nigeria's Minister of Power, Abubakar Liu, told the media conference that the low level of water at the production site was responsible for the low generation and epileptic supply. With the reduction in hydro capacity during the dry season, additional load needs to be taken up by our gas plants. The implication of low generation to the national grid does not end at low supply to the consumer, especially when the reasons given are not new. The electricity sector is a value chain sector when one segment is affected, the ripple effect cuts across. It's a problem of system planning and management. So if you have a problem, collapse, system collapse, it's simply because the system is not strong. If the energy is very high. So the means should go up that responsibility that as a problem. We are suffering now because we don't have uh, multiple sources of power generation. And what the minister was saying that because the water the water level has dropped. That is why you have you must have different mix of sources. For these two Nigerians, about his friend, the lamp at this security post has become a constant source of electricity for them to read and do their homework amid the mosquito bites and the dangers of the night. Nigeria has invested huge amounts of money to revamp the power sector. Industry watchers, however, believe that only a deliberate and holistic approach devoid of sentiment will help Nigeria achieve the desired outcome. Mwesi Igono. AIT News, Abuja.